Okay, here we go. With the VHS and DVD update. This is The Lion King, the original 1995 VHS. I don't really know why I'm keeping this, though. I mean, I used to watch this VHS all the time as a kid. This is my old copy that I've had for years. Yeah. I can never let go of it. But I'm still keeping the DVD because the DVD has that Timon and Pumbaa virtual safari bonus feature. Print date is... Um, January 15th, 1995. I think this is version 2, which, yeah, which, uh, has, uh, the Cinderella and Aristocats trailer, while also having a different version of Angels in the Outfield trailer. So, yeah. And now, here's a Lion King 2. Yes, as much as I hate this film, I'm going to keep this. But, yeah, I was actually, um, borrowing the VHS tape, uh, a little while ago. Uh, but, now that I got this, uh, might as well give that back. But, yeah, this film's awful. Stars Andy Dick, and Andy Dick sings, apparently. Disc 1, and Disc 2. And here's Jimmy Neutron, Boy Genius. Yeah, this is a classic film. I have the VHS, but I have always wanted the DVD, so yeah. I got this. As cool bonus features. Music videos, promotional bumpers, and such. It's so cool. I love this film. But yeah. Just kid ready, kid ready. Leave it up to me. We're the kids in America. Whoa. I love that. The songs are so catchy. Oh, Jimmy, Jimmy, that's the voice I hear inside. It's Jimmy Neutron. And speaking of, here's Hey Arnold, the movie. I never really liked the TV series, but I do like this movie and the Jungle movie, which I do have on my DVR. So, yeah. Mm. So, yeah. Yeah. It's just weird, though, in this film. Like, Helga finally admits to Arnold that she loves him. And yet, in the end of the film, they go back to hating each other. What kind of sense does that make? That's so stupid. But seriously, this is actually supposed to be meant... Of course you all know this was actually supposed to be meant as a TV movie. And the Jungle movie was actually originally made at the time. And that was going to be uh, a theatrical movie. But apparently the other way around it happened. Yeah. I hope to get the Jungle movie on DVD so I can erase my... So I can erase it from my DVR so I can make room for more stuff. Because I'm running very low on my DVR. Like, seriously. It's like 94%, basically. It's kind of sad. I really don't want to delete everything. Because there's some stuff that is very hard to find. Like some episodes of Barney and Friends with the Barney Says segment. So, yeah. But I'm not done, so I'm just going to give you a little sneak peek at a new video I'm planning on doing called uh, My Teletubbies Dreams 2 Fun and Games. It's a sequel to My Teletubbies Dreams videos that I did a, a long time ago on YouTube, like a few years ago. There's lots of different things I want to tell you about. Dreams I had about Teletubbies. Like a Teletubbies baseball game. Yeah. There's also dreams about other stuff like the Stanley Parable. Yeah, the Stanley Parable. It's a good game. And I want to ask you something. 
What would it be like if there was an It's All How You Look At It TV series? A TV series based on those old bumpers that they used to show after an episode of Teletubbies. Where it's like, it's all how you look at it. I would love to see a TV series out of it. What do you think that would be like? Well, see you later.